Hey, what's up you guys, Lad Direction here, and today I'm bringing you this video on the Minecraft People's Channel. Uh, first of all, thank you for letting me post this video up on your channel, and thank you for the sponsorship offer. I am definitely going to enjoy this opportunity to hopefully grow. I'm currently very happy with the amount of subs I've got. 62 is definitely something to be proud of and I am still definitely trying to get more and I see this as a great opportunity uh, what I'm bringing you today is something a bit different because I know you guys can be like oh it's not that different it's only minecraft but uh, it is different if you look at the weather it's snowing well it only seems to be snowing over there but um, it is a snowy level and personally I've never seen anyone play a snowy map before so I'm definitely going to give it a go and see why everyone hates it. I know usually, <laughs> usually when I spawn a snowy map, I just back out, delete it, and uh, attempt to get another one. And when I first downloaded the game, it took me four map attempts to get the normal map. I thought something was broken. I was like, what the fuck is going on here? But no, it just was the unlucky spawn, I guess, of the game. And here I'm just trying to grab some more wood before we set off on our journey. Now what I like to do is whenever I start a new world, definitely go to the first few trees you see and rape them of their wood. Take away their manhood and take away their wood. Because uh, wood is definitely what you need to start off in the game. And so that's all good. And I wouldn't be bringing you this uh, episode if it wasn't for an excellent help from some other person on YouTube. I can't remember his name right now, I'll try to put the link in the description, but uh, depending on the rules of the Minecraft people, I don't know if that's going to work. But I would definitely like you guys to go sub him up, because he did a tutorial on how to take my laptop apart and remove the huge bit of dirt and dust and fluff that was clogging my fan. I, when I took the laptop apart, I found it right in the corner of <coughs> the fan and it's a good two centimeter by two centimeter cube I guess of just pure fluff and no wonder my fan wasn't working I had to go out and buy an external fan and all this other bullshit and no wonder it wasn't working it was definitely a huge bit of fluff so I'm glad now that it working and that will mean that my laptop will overheat and turn off when I try to render a video hopefully so you can definitely be expecting a whole lot more content from me and my bonus live direction. Say hi, live direction. Oh, hey, let me jizz in your face. Uh, okay, save that for later. <laughs> I'm not even gonna start the whole talking to my penis during a commentary thing. You know, I thought I'd give it a try and sound, sounded a bit horrible right there. Now, you guys are probably thinking that. Why do the trees? Why do the tra trees look different? Why does the dirt look different? Why does the stone look different? And that is because I have installed a Minecraft texture pack. And what a texture pack does is it just changes the look of the whole world around you. So I, I, I think that's personally. I think personally that that's a really good idea and concept. And I'm really glad that um, Notch allowed us well allow people to make these I'm not gonna say us cuz I don't make them I just abuse them and use them to our own advantage now I'm just gonna make some tools here so we can mine out this home and this episode is just gonna be me introduce myself to you guys and see what sort of response I get so hopefully it's gonna be good and we can carry on making some videos so I'm not going to go through the whole, oh this is how you make a pick and this is how you can make a shovel because I'm sure that if you're on a Minecraft channel and you've obviously searched Minecraft and if you've searched Minecraft it's probably because you've watched Minecraft before in which case I'm very happy because we all love Minecraft Oh yes, cave! Find! Haha, <laughs> epic! We can explore that sometime I love it when I find a cave right near where I build my first house That was pretty goddamn lucky but nice um, I'm not really a fan of low ceilings, so I'm gonna dig one floor down. I think I love I like about three blocks high to four.
four blocks high. I say that's a good sort of room room height <coughs> and size. Have them as big as you want. Awesome. Put awesome. I'm gonna mim your door right now. I'm sure you all also know how to make a door, but if not, it's just as shown in this video. And you're obviously probably well, not obviously, but you're probably wondering what sort of skin I've got in this hand here, and that is my uh, anonymous skin. Uh, if any of you are part of 4chan or B, as a lot of people call it, then you probably know what this skin is. It's like sort of take off as the of the V for Vendetta mask and shit like that. It's good stuff. Good stuff. Woohoo! Anonymous for the win. Beat hard. Now I'm I'm not beat hard, but I love uh, listening and watching the work of the beat hards at work. If any of you know who those are, I'm not gonna delve too far into that in fear of uh, losing the game. And also. You probably won't know, understand what that means either, but that's the whole fun of <laughs> being anonymous, I guess. So, I've got my wooden tools at the moment, but I want to make stone tools because they obviously work better. As, once again, you probably know. So, that's probably just boring for you. And this is definitely going to be a nice little sort of spawn hut that I've got here. Make a nice little step. And a pressure plate. Now, when you're making a pressure plate, I know it can be pretty obvious that you want to put a pressure plate on each side of a door. But no, seriously, because um, as I found pretty harshly, monsters, if they step on your pressure plate, monsters will open your door. And if they open your door and you're in a little room like this, chances are you're dead and you're cooked. So quit being so lazy. To get out, you stand on it and go out, and it'll close behind you. To go in, all you have to do is press it once, walk over the plate, come off it, and there you go. In, door closed, sorted. Don't have to worry about anything coming in. Don't have to worry about, well, you. <laughs> I was going to say, don't have to worry about anything getting out, but if you go out, then it'll probably be on your Come on, pig. Like, that's another good thing about this texture pack is the pigs are actually muddy. Dirty. You dirty pig. Take me to bed. No, no, no. Uh, not a bad map by the looks of things. I'm just going to render it out fully. Oh, look at the sun in this texture map as well. That's nice, nice. Nice, nice, baby. Uh, in the house. I don't even know why I ran to the house there. Um, I think that's about it for you, for you guys for now. Uh, leave me your feedback. Tell me what you think. And um, if there's any negative feedback, try not to be too negative about it I guess please <laughs> I am only trying to bring you guys entertainment but uh, it, obviously if you don't like it let me know and if you've got any tips for me to pre if you have any tips for me to improve then also let me know because I'm not really s used to this whole commentary business yet so it would definitely be useful for feedback from you guys but um, thanks for watching guys come check out my channel I make free YouTube backgrounds and stuff like that so I'll see you guys later. Thank you the Minecraft people once again for allowing me to post this video. Uh, goodbye. I guess I'll see you later. This is like the fourth time I've said it. Goodbye guys.